All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Last time we were here, we would we had come up to the north over here and tried to hinder the, or I wanted to try to derail the rail line, but um, there was nothing there to derail with. Um, so we ended up coming down through this way and kind of opening up this region, adding about 15 warriors. I, I think we added almost like 15 or 20 warriors. So we have two more, two main camps now that we're going to get this one fully upgraded and try to keep 30 in this one. I went ahead, uh, we hindered the enemy here, but I went ahead and added this camp. And we're going to keep them in smoke signals because guess what's all around? All this stuff. Look at all this. Oh my gosh. So guess what we're going to do today? Yeah, that's right. That's where we're going. Well, we're going to go over there and we're going to hinder the enemy. So we are well rested. We are fed and watered and ready to go. We have some heavy arrows and we have some toxic arrows. I prefer to use the heavy bow, although I do enjoy using the medium bow as well, or the medium arrows and the bow that goes with that as well. I think I've discussed this before, but it's also one of those things where um, the bow, it almost it locks on faster than the war bow. But I use the war bow um, just in case I need to actually kill somebody. But for the most part, I try to intimidate everybody, so that's what we're going to try to do. We're out in the plains, we have a few toxic arrows, and we're going to go see what we can do. I don't know if I want to attack this fort, though, in the daytime. So, let's let's take a little side, uh, side trip over here, just till it gets dark. Um, let me make sure I have my, yeah, I don't want to shoot toxic arrows at him. Boom. So we don't usually find a lot of pelts, which is a little unfortunate. What do we have here? We have 23,000 SP. Let's go ahead and look at our skills as a hunter. I think as a chief, we have these ones unlocked, yep, to where they can find those specific things. But we don't, so maybe we'll do that one. And then improved sneak. I thought we had done that one. Anyway, so we're going to go ahead and improve our sneak. That way, we don't get seen. And let's see, while I'm thinking about it, I wonder if I can add an order here. So they have these hunting um, items ready. So let's go ahead and add an order for um, some pelts here. I want to go ahead and get some... Buffalo pelts going, if they can. I don't know if there's buffalo out here. And maybe some boar pelts as well. And we'll just try to keep a little bit of a stockpile of those for when we want to upgrade. And we need to keep an eye on this one. I really put sure probably should come move this camp because it's it is literally right in the middle of a stupid uh, wood gatherers camp. Is this boars? I thought it was yeah. I was say I thought it was wolves. Well, I guess it could be anything, right? Yeah. Yay, one boar pelt. Cool. Well, that that's nice to have. Um, anything else around here? I feel like it's a it should be a boar one instead of a uh, wolf, but we'll see if we get jumped here. Or 
we're sending them out for buffalo pelts anyways, we may as well gather some ourselves. Buffalo hunting. Nice. So it would seem that... And see, that's why I wanted to clear out this region here. Because... Good, it looks like they're hunting all right. Hopefully we don't lose any guys. Um, I wanted to clear this region just so that way I could see who was coming, if they come at all. Well, now we're going to have to drop off the goods here, but we need to find those wolves. I kind of want to clear that area out, or clear them out of the area. There they are. was he? Huh. What the devil? Okay. There's the boar. Where was that stupid wolf? Was he further up than I thought, huh? There he is. No? Well, he was running right at us. Jeez. Oh, I'm probably running right by him. It's one of those things where you can you can be looking right at it, but if you're looking at somewhere else on the screen, you're not gonna see him, so Was there just the one? Okay, good. Well, good. I guess we should go get a few more heavy arrows, just in case. So typically, whenever I'm going, when I'm riding, I usually keep like 10 or 15 or maybe 20 heavy arrows, just in case we run into trouble. And then I'll keep some tox toxic arrows. But last time, I did upgrade the stone throw, so that way we can... Uh, actually just throw rocks at the enemy and stun them like that. I'm not a big fan of using... There we go. I'm not a big fan of, of using uh, stun arrows. Nice. Lots of good stuff here. Just because I feel like they're kind of clunky and the and the if if the enemy sees you and i understand that they're they're supposed to uh, you're supposed to they're not supposed to see you you're supposed to use them to stun but usually when you stun one they all see you unless it's at night i mean um, the comment by michael nielsen about uh, attacking at night that's not it's absolutely true so if you can take out the guards without being seen at night and everybody's still sleeping then that is definitely the best way to do it absolutely and we've done that too in the past where you if you can go if you can get if you can get there while they're sleeping let's see 
It is 112, okay. It's not really the best time of day to be attacking, but we'll go at least start scoping it out. And if we get spotted, we'll we'll run away. We will run away. We'll go ahead and save our boda bag until we're super, super, duper thirsty. And our sneak is better, so hopefully we will do better this time. And then after we take out these ones, we should probably... Um, upgrade our detect enemies that way we can at least de detect a little bit further right you know you know what I'm trying to say yeah you don't know what I'm trying to say so if you're gonna attack at night the best thing to do that's the best time because half of these guys will be sleeping there's another guy out there. Oh, he's at the wagon. Okay. So we'll just try to make our way around. Try to get as many of these guys on the radar as we can. And then we'll go to the next one where we they actually have warriors um, in jail there. We'll go to the little jail one. And we'll do that one too. Yeah, the AI, they know we're here. <laughs> All right, Felipe. No, 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 no. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you where everything is. Start talking. What? I'll tell you where everything is. I've already told you everything. Nice. Kind of want to see just to make sure that there's not like somebody standing right here. Okay, we should be good. Leon! Take old Leon over here. kind of have these crappy weapons too. Go ahead and do another enemy detect. Because as they start to shift around, I don't want to get caught off guard by somebody that's here. And then we'll try to go over to that side and grab that guy. Okay, so there's four guys over here. But let's go this way. 
and try to stealthfully nab this guy, assuming there's not somebody right here, so we'll check. It doesn't look like it. Pierre. I'll tell you anything. I'll tell you where he's hiding. Please take the knife away. Hey. So there are advantages to attacking at night for sure, but you can do it in the daytime too. Because we haven't detected here. Let's go ahead and just make sure there's not somebody on the inside of the wall here. Okay, one, two, three, four, five guys. Okay. That's not a huge fort. So those guys are going to see us, for sure. Too bad we can't go in there. Let's make sure nobody's coming. Yep, see? Here come those dadgum wood gatherers. Once they get too close, we'll send a group over, just because we're here right now. We're busy, and they always come when you're busy, unfortunately. Where's this guy? Where's the other guy? Okay, that, and actually we need, let's drop this rusty watch. Take horses, yes. And... Yeah, we'll do a buck brush. Probably could send him with some actual... Where are they? Let's do 50. Hopefully they can make it out. I really hate doing that. I, I have learned in the past that that is not... You always want to typically try to be there to help them out, but... Sometimes you just can't always be there. And that's the one that we really need to get rid of in there because that is in literally in the middle. In the 
in the middle of their wood camp. And you guys probably saw it whenever I did it, but I didn't see it. <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead and get out of here. Go put some of these extra things on the horse here that we've gathered. Lots of pelts and stuff, so that's good. Okay, so they're in combat. Hopefully they can do good. Get them, boys. Hey, look. Nice, okay. I didn't realize we had that open. Good to know. So I can't hold that much meat. Me either, dude. Me either. Okay, so they were able to take out those guys. So a lot of times my strategy personally is to have a couple of main camps and then camps around. So as they come in and they start to try to attack my camps, I can send groups from both of these areas to help assist them. That's that's kind of what I do. That is my strategy and it's 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 not a, it hasn't been bad. Okay, so we got a guy walking around now. Where is he going? Is that inside or outside? This other guy. You can do it. There you go. <laughs> Over there. Go oh, on and break your, break your neck. What? <laughs> that guy over there, Cowley. Okay, so that guy is outside. Well, they should be coming in. And my plan is to take all these out. Look at all this. Oh my gosh, we still need to come all the way down here. Where is the rail line? There it is. Really kind of hard to see there. Right there. Up to this camp. Doesn't, okay, so it doesn't look like they've gone any further than where we stopped them before. So that's good. This guy's still stuck inside the building. Come on, boys, get back inside. It's almost time to get. Very thirsty. See, now we'll use the... Gulp, gulp, gulp. Okay, as long as we're not carrying around a stupid empty one. might be a little too close. <laughs> oh, 
All right, well, good. <laughs> that worked out okay. We don't want to take this one here. Okay. Well, we'll kind of scope it out and see what they have. We'll end up leaving, probably leaving weapons and. See if we can't go around here. Get behind this guy. Send a group together, would. Let's see. Oh, yes, for arrows, yep. Wow, good job, boys. Okay, so let's go ahead and get some stack pelts going, huh? Let's add an order. Stag pelts. There we go. Now this one was relatively easy, but the guys were there was only a few or high, a few high level guys here, not not a lot. Most of the guys were not very high in level. There we go. Look the other way, buddy. This is where I would usually use the stone throw. But, like, like I said, I like to interrogate them to get information. <laughs> See if we can get this guy. <laughs> there we go. There's one down. Um, we'll start just looking around, see what we can find. I like to I like to see empty stuff. 
So we'll go ahead and put these in there. And then definitely take like the ammo and I don't really want to take those, but, and these are heavy. And we could definitely use the fire, you know, to take these things along, but I don't really feel like taking everything along yet. That and typically there's way too much stuff to hold. I'll just take kind of the stuff we're needing for now, like the pelts and stuff and the tusks. Meat, that's easy to come by. Meat is easy enough to come by. Carolina gun cylinder, sure. Now that we have all of our boys looking for stuff for us, we can we can manage to take just the little bits here. And I could probably get rid of that other weapon. Take those for when we want to hinder, hinder the enemy. So let's go. Let's go ahead and get out of here. Good stuff. Good stuff. I feel like we're doing pretty good as well as far as hindering the enemy, but we haven't really gotten to the point where the cavalry is bothering us and all that stuff. So whenever they get to where they're sending like 10 guys at a time per patrol or something like that's when it's like, Oh my gosh, dude. So these guys are right on the edge of the enemy territory. This is still hindered here. So let's go ahead and go that way. We'll light up that fire and drop off all the stuff and then we'll release some more warriors. So that's good. New warriors is nice. Or more warriors. Trying to stay away from them. As best as I can here. So let's go ahead and... Hey, come on. There we go. Things are running a little slow here. Um, I kind of want to start putting more stuff here. That way we have two. Enemy settlement is too close. Well, dead, damn it. Ay, ay, ay. Come on, dude. Just take the picture. There we go. Too bad there's not one closer. <laughs> this thing, go. There. Well, we'll just ride over this direction. I guess this one's just as close. 
So we'll go to this one, drop the crap off here, and then start at that at that jail instead. So either way it works. So I'm just trying to free more warriors so we can upgrade our camps and have more guys ready to go. Yes, but if you like this land is my land, and you like this video, go ahead and actually like the video. It helps uh, it helps the YouTube to push the videos out to more people. That way I can get more subscribers. That's that's like the ultimate goal. You know, when I started this YouTube channel, I did it, I'm doing it just for fun, honestly. But I, for some reason, maybe in my ignorance, well, we'll just talk while we sit here and wait for it to unfreeze. In my ignorance, I was thinking that the like, watch time would be the one thing that would be difficult, but it's actually not. It's actually subscribers. That's I just didn't know that. I wasn't expecting that. So if you guys like the videos, make sure you like them. That way more people can watch them. And we can get more subscribers. And we're actually doing really good. I mean, I'm up to like 120 subs. That's that's awesome. That's really cool. That's really good. I mean, I've gained like 20 in the last couple of weeks. I mean, it's not bad for me. Considering I started like six months ago. I think that's pretty good. And like I said, I want to I want to have this as a spot where people can watch videos, but then hopefully read the comments as well, because I don't have a community. I, I, you have to get monetized to have community, and I don't have that yet. But um, I want to be able to have a community, so that way people that want to play the game can actually play the game and see better ways of doing it, which is why I encourage, you know, if you have suggestions on how to play the game, let me know because uh, that way people will see it in the comments and do that. Look at all of this stuff. Holy wow. This is crazy. I feel bad for these guys here and these guys actually. Well, a little hungry. It's nighttime, so let's go see what we can attack and kill. Oops. <laughs> this one, dude. Make sure nobody's coming out to in investigate. You see that? Is that a fellow right there in front of the door? Or is that the door? I don't know. Yep, that's a guy in front of the door. Okay. Well, good. We'll take that guy out. It sounds like other people are sleeping, so... Pluses all around. I like to, uh, like I said, I like to interrogate, but here we are. They just usually have some useful information, so. Get up here and do another detect. Make sure there's not somebody really close by. Oops. Stop. 
All right, James. I'll, I'll tell you whatever you want to know. No. Oh. Better kill me now. I'm not one of those cowards from. Yeah. Wait, I'll tell you. I'll tell you. He's over there. Please don't hurt me. Okay, okay. No, 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 no. I I'll talk. Please stop. I I I'll tell you where the items are. Okay, okay. No, no, oh, wow. no. I I'll talk. Please stop. I'll tell you where he is. Let's make sure we have the right one on for a change here, huh? Do you? Please, enough. He's over there. I already. Maybe this is the last one. Oh, okay. Good. Any fellas in here? Nope. All right, boys. Go ahead and get these guys out of here. Make a nice war party, arm them up, and then send them off to camp. Hi, boys. Just wait there. We're going to give you this. This and this and this and a melon and some meats to hold. Oh, he can take them all. Good. Five, five more guys. That's great. That's all I see anyways thus far. Go ahead and have these guys come over here. Make sure we don't have any patrols coming around. You guys just wait there for a second. While I look around. Yeah. Boys need to carry some of this stuff. Take this. And this. And this apple. And the sinew. See, that's why I don't even worry about sinew. Good. Buffalo horns. That's good stuff to have. This, this poor fool got stuck carrying it all. This poor guy. Okay, so he's fully loaded. And he is... Okay, what about you? A little bit. A little bit of stuff. All good things, all good things. What else? Nice, guys. These guys are able to loot the whole thing. That's awesome. Okay, so I want these boys to go ahead and mount up. 
take whatever horses there are. So we'll go ahead and loot everything here. Assuming it's not some bunch of stupid stuff. See, that's... Oh, man. I know we need glue for some stuff, but <clears throat> we just... Uh, whoa, whoa. That's empty, and this has some stuff. Hopefully the horse, I don't know. I don't think I had him full. Yeah, we had emptied him out. Come here, buddy. Oh, we need to upgrade him, though. We'll give that. Should we give that weapon to one of the guys? Probably. Probably should, because... It's all these fish, man. They get they're super heavy, but he's like, I can't carry all that crap. Yep, me either, buddy. Me either. <laughs> so we're probably gonna have to drop some of the horns, if, unless there's something else that we can get rid of. Because we kind of need it all, but we don't need three meat. Okay. Okay, boys. I want you guys to go back to the nearest camp. And then we'll We'll distribute later. Cool. Well, there's five more warriors. Definitely, sh probably should have gotten a drink before I burned this down. Ah, I'm burning alive. But, but we didn't. Okay, good. So they're riding off in that direction, which is fine because we'll probably need to send one more up here. And there are plenty here. Um, well, we need to send to settle another camp, huh? Let's see. Go ahead and send five. Take horses. No, no, no. This one. So here's a road. Okay, there's nothing over there. So if we send guys to go settle there, there's nothing there. So we could have them here. It's kind of close to a road, but... I mean, where where is there? I mean, other than... No, nope, there's a road all along there. So that looks like the right one. Yes, and we'll send five guys with horses. Equip the group. But let's, uh, we don't have any more, like, real good ones. These are nice, regular quality. Give them one of these. And some 60 cal. Remove that one, and then oh, it seems like to send them with a little bit extra. Hopefully that's not too much. Okay, good. So now they have extra ammo. Oh, they probably need some meat too, huh? Let's send them with some meat. And where's the raw meat? Raw meat. Okay, where's our meat? Did we... we should have boatloads of it. Am I not seeing it here? Probably down here with the pelts. Yep. T 
10. So we'll go ahead and give them 10 more. Split them off that way we're not over anywhere. And now let's go, oh, okay, because this one's going to be over now. But we can just send one up to here. Oh. Oh my gosh, this guy. Well, he's stuck there. Um, well, what, what can you do, right? So we're going to go there real quick, and then we're going to dump this stuff off, and then we're going to continue to burn down this region because this is a busy area, and we're pushing down into enemy territory, and that's what this game is all about. Advancing and hindering, advancing and hindering, and yada yada yada. Yes. All right, buddy. Let me have all your stuff. Give me all your goods. Put it all back here. And I've said it in the past, I'm just going to say it now. For people that are just watching, just starting to watch, I usually put everything at my main camp because I don't want it to get taken if I if a camp gets taken over. You know what I mean? Like if a camp gets wiped out by the cavalry or something, I don't want to lose that stuff that might be at another camp. Does that make sense to everybody? I hope so. Um... <laughs> We are carrying quite a bit of stuff here. We have light puncture, or puncture light bleeding. This here heals everything, so maybe we just need one for, for, oh, take one for that. Let's go ahead and put these back. Light beating, heavy bleeding, dirty puncture, light bleeding, light, or puncture, light bleeding, and festering wound. All right, just to lighten our load a little bit. <coughs> okay, I want to come up here and take this one, but we're already here, so. But you know what we need to do? What does he need, that golden tonic? This is the goldenrod tonic. Let's see how we make that. Um, there it is. Golden rod tonic. So this takes golden rod leaf. How many? One. How many did did the horse need? I don't know. Let's just take them all. How many do you need, buddy? Was it five? Five. Okay, so let's go ahead and make those for the old horse here. 3.30 in the morning, we're already wasting our night, but that's okay. We got one taken care of. Five. Drop the rest off here. And boost our horse. So now he has his increased horse speed. Uh, I'm hoping the next one will be like an increase in weight that he can carry, but we'll see. Okay, so this is a farm. You know what I kind of want to do though, if, since this is a farm. Let's get a let's get one of the fires. That way, if when it comes down to it, I like to use the fires, but only if we're if we're going to gain a lot of stuff. So I'll load us down with groceries. Ah! I'll load us down with groceries, and then so let's take one of those. Okay. You hold the fire, okay? All right. Let's 
still thirsty. That's why the boda bags are a little better, but oh well. Always come over here just in case they come out to investigate. Okay, let's. We have some SP here. I was going to see if we can't upgrade our detect enemy skill. Well, we need a little more. A lot of times these guys at the farms don't sleep either. There's always... Wait, is this guy looking? I guess he saw me. It's just hard to see in those bushes there. Oh, it looks like he finally made it back. I'm sure the river is going to be dirty if these guys are right here. Yeah. So let's go this way. <laughs> Just to get an idea of who's here. Now sometimes if these guys are low level, you can get up into the farm area during the day and actually just kind of take them out one by one while they are Catch that guy. There he is. So that they're just in full view. He's in full view right there because all the guys are at the camp or in the middle of the camp there. So we'll go this way. See if we can't ambush some of these guys.
Look at that guy on the rock. What an idiot. Beware of the rocks. It kind of pops you up out of your cover as well. Oh man. What is this? Let me guess. That's the last time he's ever going to eat snake kebabs. Take the picture. Empty one ways point two. So it's eight o'clock in the morning, and we it's. What do you see? What's not right here? Other than the fact that there's nowhere to hide. Oh, what the devil? <laughs> well, when did he get back over here? Oh my gosh. Well, you know what this calls for. Watch out, dude. Well, they have a lot of weapons, huh? Okay, we can still take them on, even though they're...
Want to get that guy on the radar. See if I can pick this guy up. I want to get to these two guys, but they're kind of out in the middle of nowhere. Oh, he ran off. Maybe I can sneak up here and grab the boss. Grab that guy right there. Dangerous? Yes. Because we're living on the edge. <laughs> Close! Get out of there! Oh sh... What the... What the hell's going on? <laughs> Wasn't even aiming at the tree. Wasn't anywhere near the tree. That's baloney. Baloney. Total BS. Well, stay down. <laughs> Got him. Got him. Well, yeah, we are... Not the uh, most ideal thing, but...
Reasonably priced, okay. Back to toxic. Can I not throw a rock? I guess I can't. I guess I can't. Let's see. You know who we need to find is that one guy. That one guy that we don't have on the radar. We need to find that guy because he's, I think he keeps, unless we shot him, I don't know. Got him. We didn't even have to kill him. On a day when we don't have to kill everybody, that's I consider that a win. I don't know where that guy's going. The enemy's here. I repeat, the enemy is here. I was gonna say, but I know this guy's gonna see me. Run, huh, run, dude! This guy's a freaking dead eye. Damn it! How the flipping hell? Yep, I know. But dude, okay, attack at night. Okay, I get it, but still, you can attack him in the day. We just got a whole fort. We took a whole fort, so I don't want to hear it. You can't, you got to attack all the time. There's only so much daytime, only so much nighttime. Okay, are we going to load? Okay. Now I'll tell you what we're not going to do. We're not going to take any weapons. 
We're not going to take anything. We're just going to go over here and get these guys. Dude, every time I'm running and I push this, this one. Okay, well, at least I can throw a rock. Where's old Deadeye, huh? And of course, what the heck? They have like reinforcements up the freaking. Jeez. We're getting to that point in the game, huh? Where if you don't get it, you get every. They all get reinforced. There should have only been two guys left here. But there ain't. There's a whole bunch. So what we're going to do is we're going to sit over here, kind of out of sight, because let's see, it is, it is four o'clock. going to smoke somewhere. And we're going to waste a little bit of time. And we'll wait for the cover of darkness and see if we can't take this one out with that. Now, here's an interesting question that I've never thought about asking. Do you guys know, is there a set time when these guys actually go to bed? Like, as far as AI says, okay, now it's time for bed. I don't know the answer to that, so... I mean, I know that they get up about, like, if it's 5.30 and the sun's coming up, they get up. But is there a time when they go to bed? Eight o'clock, I guess. For some of them. Let's go ahead and make sure we get all these guys, because, yep, there's one. Right there in front of us. And another one by the campfire. I don't know if there's any more over here. Oh, there's a is that a wagon? Or is that that other campfire? Is my stuff here? Man, the game is playing really glitchy. Okay, so... Okay, so...
I need to understand what I can do to get the people of Tatikok to leave my land. Maybe I should find and interrogate a few group leaders. Okay. Just in case. Because we can't see over here. So I think that's the other campfire. I was going to go see if there's not some guys sleeping over there. Dude, this game is playing really slow today. I, I mean, I think I know why, but I don't think you guys would care why. If you must know, I think it's because I'm rendering videos to, to put up. Nobody. Okay, so I think this is what we have on the map now. So let's see what kind of damage we can do. We'll check again. And what we can do too, guys, is we can also poison them. We could put some poison down. If we felt so inclined to do that. See, there's only two guys in the whole camp sleeping. Gosh, these guys, they go over there for just a second and then they go sit down again. So that guy, where is he, huh? I think it's the boss. So which way is that guy looking? How much SP do we have? Let's see. Let's get the spyglass just so we can see. Yeah. Okay, he's looking that way. We might be able to go this way. I doubt it. Look at this guy over here. Go to sleep. He's looking away. Yeah, that's about right. If you're too slow, the the boss will end up coming out. So. Gosh, dude, this thing, every time I hit tab to close it out, it always zooms back in. It's going really slow. Come on, dude. Anything you want to know. Hey, hey. Would be nice to have just known that right away. If you don't have nothing to say, shut up. Okay. Well, 
What is this guy doing? Is he like at the campfire or is he... I can't tell where that guy is. Yeah. I'll tell you. I'll tell you. Hey, no. It's not right here. Don't need to wake everybody up, buddy. There's no need for that. Wow, look at all the fish. That's cool. Alright, so now we need to take this guy out and then we can hopefully get the guys that are sleeping. Is he just sitting there? Okay, now comes the easy money part. So I'm not saying I disagree with attacking at night, but Okay, well, didn't learn anything from these guys. So the value of attacking at night is increased, I would say, because obviously half the cramp, half the camp is asleep. That being said, I mean, I don't just attack at night because there's things that need to be done all the time. So. You guys had a lot of nice weapons though. Okay, well that's it for this one. What else do we have around here? Well there's lots of stuff. What don't we have around here, huh? That's the real question. So we're making some strides, but they are also making strides too. That's it, buddy. I'll drop that one. 
Okay, half a pound. Weighs a lot, I guess, huh? Okay, let's look around for our stuff. Yeah. Don't really want that stuff. No, I won't take that either. We don't need the uh, meat, really. Oops. Okay. That's... These are all low quality. I'm gonna take what I can and then go from there. Find my so is there somebody around? I feel like I hear something. This is a good one, but we can drop this stuff. I don't, I know you can use this stuff for shock, but I don't usually use that stuff for anything, so. The fish are heavy. Golden pocket watch, well, we had, and we have these, so. Let's just make a little bit of room. So hopefully we find our bow. I guess it's not the end of the world if we don't, because we can always make another one. I guess. Let's see what this has to say. <clears throat> um, maybe. Maybe. <clears throat> On July 13th, we were informed that a sabotage was carried out in that place, Shack and Dao, but un by unknown persons which suspended the movement of trains. The railway company has assured that that they sort <laughs> has assured that that they would sort it out in short time and restore the operability of the railway okay well good to know Okay. That one's empty. What does this have to say? Dear business partner, I have just learned that New Dale has sent out a group in search of wood. Okay. Speaking of which. Well, I don't see him yet, so. So that's good. That's mine. These are mine. Just try to take as much ammo as we can and burn it to the ground. A lot of times they have a lot of stuff and I want to come in and take it all, but not after we get killed. I'm like, me, we'll just burn it down. <laughs> we'll just burn it all down. And these are what, 44s? Okay. I don't know if we're going to find our bow, huh? Yep, there it is. I'm going to take this one and we'll, we're going to, before I take off, we'll 
see what we need for like to make the salves and stuff. We'll see what, which ones take that. Let's check it now. So to craft the salves, it is, um, well, it's under one of these, isn't it? Okay, striped bass and golden trout, and rainbow trout and kokanee col salmon. Okay, let's see what we have. I guess I could cut them, huh? And see, make sure we don't get any. Let's make sure we didn't get any row. That way we can make our own. That would be cool. Don't really need cloth. I don't need that. We don't do the 30 second ones. It takes too long. Okay, so we have plenty of room here, but we didn't get any row. I don't know if I don't have that. That was my problem last time too. I didn't have a, I didn't have the row unlocked or whatever. Let's see, where's the, Where's the water barrel? I can't see it. Is that it? This one? Nope. Nope. Oh well. We'll just uh, go to the river or go up river a little bit. There we go, good grief. Big fire, all right. Well, let's go check it out, Chester. farm. That's what I wanted to get. The Oh, these guys are producing transport groceries, alcoholic drinks. Okay. Well, we got some decent weapons. I think this is clean. Nice. We'll ride while we eat. Very good, okay. So we haven't added as many, gosh. We haven't added as many uh, warriors as we did last time, but it can't be super great every time, you know? Sometimes it's just the makings of the game, and that's what we do, we just come and we play to have fun. Playing to have fun, that's part of the game. And that's what I do. I'm not the best at every game. I'm not very good at any games, but I like to have fun. Okay. 
Well, let's go take out one more. How do? Why not? This one. Or this one. Well, we got the fire, so that way we could use it at the grocery, like at a farm that's a grocery. So we can send all that stuff back to camp and then distribute it around the map to all of our camps. But maybe we'll go check that one out. How much longer do we have a rainstorm? You know, it looks like it's going to be around for a while. I think it's moving that direction. Well, I know we can do this one now. Um, this one. Have a little more extended range. And the farms are usually pretty well protected. Hopefully it's not too late in the in the night. Maybe we can catch these guys sleeping. Nope, let's see a lot of them don't sleep at all. A lot of them don't sleep at all. Maybe though, we'll go see. I was gonna say, watch us walk up on a guy. Yeah, the farms are usually pretty well defended, so we just need to be careful here. Nobody sleeping in this rainstorm, huh? There they are. Dead gummit. Honestly, it's the same with stun arrows, though. You stun one, and it's like, huh? See if we can't catch some more guys here. Let's see, two, four, six, eight, ten. 
11, 12, 30, 40, 50. <laughs> So a lot of times what we can do is come in here and poison them. But you need a fire nearby and that's kind of a pain because the groceries are so heavy. This guy close? Hard to tell with all the all the shrubs. Yeah, no, he's not. Oh. Looking at the wrong guy. Let's try this one. Everyone get ready. Where they are. Okay, I thought I just clicked on my I thought I just clicked on my uh, bow there, but I guess I just clicked on the arrow. Uh, but anyways, I think we're going to call it a day here. This is getting kind of long and it's just kind of, it gets repetitive after a while. The same old things all the time. You know, always getting shot at and always getting seen because now it's daytime. But see, the hard, the hard part about the farms is that they don't ever go to sleep. So, but we'll come back. We'll do it again. So, all right, guys, we're going to call it a day there. So we will see you guys on the next episode. Where, um, what are we going to be doing next time? Well. Hopefully getting away from this wood gatherers group. But we're going to uh, continue trying to resist the enemy. Or hinder the enemy. Continue our resistance. So. Alright guys. Well let's call it a day there. And we will see you guys on the next episode. All right. Bye, everybody.